So like I said, we're going to do the next flower uh, is going to be a black eyed Susan. So flip your paper over for a nice clean sheet here. And you're going to be looking at a black eyed Susan. Here's an example of my drawing. Okay, and here's an example of that photograph um, of another artist. So here's that kind of gum drop shape center with the petals overlapping coming out the side. So what we're going to do is we're going to start um, by writing the name down and you're going to write black I hate Susan and it's called a black eyed Susan because the center gumdrop shape is you know nearly black it's like super duper dark brown so what you're going to do is you're going to start with a gumdrop shape it's a straight line on a little bit of a diagonal and then a rounded curve over the top like that. Okay, now we're gonna leave that for the moment. We'll color it in in a second. Um, but the petals of your black eyed Susan are gonna be kind of drooping down. They're very like long and flimsy and they kind of droop down. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start by making a petal and all the petals should look a little different because they're all, you know, all viewing them from a different way, right? So we're gonna start by doing a curved line down and just like our daisy petals, we're going to bring them back up to the center like that. And then the next one is going to be more of a teardrop shape. And we're going to be able to see a wider distance of it there, whereas this one was more pointy. Okay, And then this one we're going to overlap like that. And another curved one, we're going to start from the edge over here and we're going to overlap it behind that one and then the last one we're going to kind of come out here and we're going to make it thin just like this first one and bring it back to a point there so it looks like you know it's hanging down and we're only seeing it kind of from the side then we're going to put on a stem it's going to start from the center pretend 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 then set your pencil down here and make your stem come down and then from here pretend pretend make your stem come down and again with the daisy they have a kind of a scraggly little leaf that comes off like that and maybe a scraggly little leaf that comes off like that then once you get that done you can color or rather shade in this center portion do it neatly kind of color in the line just so we, so we remember that this center piece is really dark and usually really brownish black um, because it's a black eyed Susan and it just has a different color than the other ones than a daisy or something okay um, if you need to make any mistakes just grab your eraser and erase it so it's nice nice and neat so there's our black eyed Susan